A few weeks ago, I ordered and unboxed a guide to Japanese role playing games by Bitmap Books, and I was actually extremely surprised what I found when I opened it up. A uh, well, actually, I wasn't all that surprised because I actually I suspected that this would be pretty high quality, and it turned out to be exactly everything that I had hoped for, uh, as you would go on to find out in my full review of it. And uh, and I decided that uh, I would go ahead and do that full review. And and when I was doing that review, I realized that they had another book that I was really, really interested in. And I knew I had to get my hands on it. And that's what we're going to be unboxing today. I've got a little bit of a different setup today, so let me know what you think of it. So let's go ahead and switch over to my desk camera here. And here you'll find the book that we have all uh, packaged up. Now this one, it came a little more uh, worse for wear here, as you can probably see if we switch back. You know, there there is a, a slight tear here. Luckily, there wasn't any rain, though, and I was working from home, so I was able to, you know, go out and, uh, and snag it before the elements could really do much to it. That said, though, <laughs> from my impressions based on the last unboxing, I don't suspect that that's going to pose to be much of an issue anyway. So let's go ahead and open her back up here and uh, and see what we've got here. And the book that we're opening up today is the CRPG book. Oh, there we go. And, uh, and what I've found here is it comes with this little thing here and you can leave a review and get 5% off your next purchase from Bitmap Books. That seems to be something that they send with each of their books. It's awesome to see that they want so much feedback. So back to the actual uh, book here. Now, this is what it looks like, I guess, when you receive the book and it's been through <laughs> a few more of the, the paces. It's been through the ringer a bit more than my uh, than my my previous uh, package. But as you can see, well, so far, it looks like the cardboard uh, took the brunt of the of the force, which uh, is exactly what we would expect to see and hope to see. So let's go ahead and open her up and see how this one arrived. Here's that pull tab and just uh, set that aside. OK, and first impressions again are that this was extremely well packaged. And there it is. All right, we'll set that cardboard aside. Uh, and all of the corner padding and everything here is in place. Excellent, excellent. All right. So how about we go ahead and open her up and uh, and see what exactly it is that's inside. I love this, by the way, I love this packaging. It is so thorough, even though the box was, like I said, really put through the ringer. I'm not really at all concerned about the shape that the book went in or is going to be in. I'm 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 positive that it's going to be mint. Oh my gosh. <laughs> yep. So compare compare the uh, the look of that of that cardboard box that I had to what we have here. Solid sharp edges on this. OK, so I'll go ahead and move some stuff out of uh, out of the way on this. On my my table here, we'll we'll get this foam out of the way. Now, I will say for comparison's sake to the uh, the guide to Japanese RPGs. Ah, let's let's make a quick comparison because it feels like, yeah, first impressions are it's a smidgen, a smidgen, a, a little bit uh, not quite as thick as the guide to Japanese role playing games. So uh, yeah, here's here's just a, a comparison of the spines. Now that that said, I did relax the spine on the guide to Japanese role playing games a bit more than this, uh, you know, so this might still be under some compression, you know, that uh, and and the guide to Japanese RPGs has had some time to breathe. But I'm guessing 
I'm, I'm fairly sure that it's not just that. This is a very substantial book. They both are very substantial books. So the CRPG book that I've gotten here is essentially the Western RPG version of the book, The Guide to Japanese RPGs. And first impressions, this again is pretty dang solid. Ah, uh, okay. Let's let's keep opening. Let's let's keep going deeper here. The CRPG book. By the way, since this is a new unboxing sort of layout and format, let me know what you guys think down below. Is this uh, is this a nice way to have the cameras all set up? Or would you prefer I go back to the table in the future? cool thing about this setup is it does allow me to edit on the fly, essentially. So, uh, there's your ASMR. Plastic is off. Oh, that is a really, <laughs> I mean, I knew, I knew to expect it. <laughs> that is such a nice looking book, though. Let's open it up carefully and just kind of take a look through some of these. Now, one of the reasons that I really wanted to make sure that I got this book is because my, I mean, based on my channel, you probably already know that my forte really is more of the Japanese RPG variety. Um, you know, I, I have really played a lot of Bethesda games and enjoyed those, the Fallout games, the, the uh, Elder Scrolls titles, but um uh, I really wanted to to learn more about CRPGs. Uh, <laughs> speaking of, there's uh, some Skyrim there. Uh, speaking of, so I wanted to to sort of learn more about CRPGs, and uh, and I feel like this game, based on my experience with the guide to Japanese RPGs, I feel like this book would be probably a very good way to go about doing that. You know, based on my experience with the guide to Japanese RPGs, I don't suspect that these guys are going to uh, steer me astray. So, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm very excited to, to start taking a deeper dive into this book and uh, and see exactly what it has going on here. So, like I was saying in my uh, guide to Japanese RPGs books, uh, you got to be pretty careful about relaxing these spines. There's uh, plenty of videos out there about uh, how to go about doing that in a way that's not going to damage. It's not going to fold here, you know, along the, the spine. That's something you really want to avoid doing. You don't want to crack the uh, the binding. That said, this does feel and look like some pretty quality binding. That is such a cool looking book. Now, CRPGs stand for computer RPGs, right? So. Uh, I did mention earlier that this is sort of like the the Western RPG style version, um, but I feel like CRPG is probably uh, the more generally accepted term, you know, of of this style of game. I don't know if this necessarily encompasses all uh, Western style RPGs or if it's just, you know, certain kinds or if it's, you know, that's exactly the sort of questions that I'm hoping that this book is going to help me answer in the long term. I definitely wanted this, especially before I started making the next chapters of How to RPG, in which I talk about the early days of, uh, well, CRPGs, computer RPGs, the transition from tabletop RPGs into the realm of computers, where the computers do the DMing instead of, uh, well, a, a person. <laughs> Spoilers. Uh, anyways. So, if you liked what you saw here, well, do be sure to get subscribed because I am Super Dark. I make thoughtful and thought-provoking videos for gamers who love RPGs and mostly JRPGs, but now soon to be CRPGs. So, uh, yeah, stay tuned because we will be diving more into uh, the uh, the RPG How to RPG series that I've been doing, and I suspect this is going to be a really big help. But uh, if you're interested in picking up this book, it is available from Bitmap Books. I do believe the JRPG book right now is currently sold out, unfortunately. Fortunately, unfortunately. Uh, but uh, I'll have links to this down below if you're interested. And I do believe I'll have a full review of this um, 
Well, I'm probably not going to read it cover to cover, but I'll do a more thorough reading of this and give some more uh, in-depth impressions of the CRPG book. But until then, take care of yourselves and I will see you all on Monday. Have a great day, everybody.